Alright, yo, what's good everyone? Nick Smith is back. So in this episode, I was meant to be facing up against the Bucks and the Miami Heat in this episode, but the recording messed up, and it turns out that I didn't actually record the video. I was an idiot. I forgot to press record. But it doesn't even matter, because now we're facing up against our rivals in the Boston Celtics, and we're facing up against the Los Angeles Clippers in the Battle of LA. So yeah, Randall's back, Kobe's back, Russell's back. Let's get into this game. And the other game as well. <laughs> uh, feeling like I gotta get it right now. Moving like a killer in the darkness out of sight now. Want another level so the devil wanna fight now. Growing up dirt broke, but it's looking bright now. Bitches on the pipe now, with the dick right now. But I can't fade, taking shots with the sight down. Uh. So the first game that we played up against was against the Boston Celtics. These guys, during trade deadline, acquired Andre Drummond. That was such a good pickup for them. And look at this, hand down, man down. You're too small, Isaiah Thomas. <laughs> nah, I like Isaiah Thomas. He shows heart. He shows dedication. That shot right there just says it all. Five feet nine or however tall he is, it doesn't even matter. And look at this, David Lee. What are you trying to do? Get, in my, get that out of here. Not in my house. Not today anyway. Randall from downtown. I mean, not Randall. <laughs> what am I talking about? Get dunked on though. Boogie is a beast. But the thing is, what I was trying to say before. i got to stop talking so quickly. What I was trying to say before is that these guys... The Boston Celtics, they got Andre Drummond. That is such a good pick up for the Celtics because in the weak conference that they are in, they they can easily make the playoffs. And getting someone like Andre Drummond to help them, because they they made it to the playoffs last year in real life without a guy like Andre Drummond. They had Isaiah Thomas for about half the year. These guys seriously, I don't know, just because they're in such a weak conference, they can do some work, and in this My GM series, since they acquired Andre Drummond, it was such a good move for them. So, I'm eager to see if they can actually play really well in this My GM series, because I wouldn't even be surprised. Isaiah Thomas, Andre Drummond, Jay Crowder, Marcus Smart, it's not a bad team. Obviously, they have to get rid of David Lee, because he has a huge contract, but I don't know, man. These guys in, in this My GM series, they could be something else. Getting Andre Drummond was a big pickup for them. It, it's what it's what they need. If I had to choose a position for the for the Celtics to get in real life, I'd have to say the center position is struggling. I mean, they have Jared Salinger, but he runs the power four position. So, yeah, I mean, Boogie, Drummond, someone like that in real life, that'd be a nice pickup for the Celtics. And it's exactly what they did in this much GM series. But as you can see, we're in the last quarter right now. We're down by five points. It's time to come back and win this game. Kobe Bryant up against the Celtics, he needs to do something special. He does that right there. Hitting that three and getting that to fall. Boogie dunks it on Andre Drummond right there. I, I really like Andre Drummond for those that don't know. I'm a fan of Andre Drummond. I don't know. I like his hustle. I like his defense. And talking about defense, Denied. get that out of here. Not in my house. You might catch me on the road and one. But yeah, Agent Zero got that song stuck in my head. He was singing it the other day and I was like... That's a pretty good song. That reminds me of some Ben Wallace action right there. But uh, yeah, Oladipo gets the M1 to go. This man, D'Angelo Russell with the steal. And N1 to Julius Randle. The rookies or the second year players are coming in clutch right now. It's a really clutch moment for, for Randle. And Randle is somebody that you guys need to get. His stats might not look good in this game. Like, I don't know, they're, they're not bad. But they're all kind of average. All of his stats or attributes in this game are just average. But when you play with him, he's a beast. He can play defense. He can do offense. It's weird. He's just he's just really good. I really like playing with Julius Randle. And also, one of the best pickups that I've ever got is Gerald Green. This man, Gerald Green, is a beast. And you're going to see it in the next game in about, like, two minutes. We face up against the Clippers and Gerald Green goes off. And you're going to see it in the episode. You're going to see Gerald Green do some amazing dunks and go to work. But this man, Boogie, is a cheat code. I was talking to Funky, and or he said it in his videos, that, that DeMarcus Cousins is a cheat code. He has, in fact, talking about Boogie and the Celtics, he, if you guys want to watch my GM series, definitely go subscribe to Funky's channel. There is a link in the description to go and subscribe to his channel. Crazy my GM videos. He's trying to you know grow his channel out. So be I'd, I'd appreciate it if you guys could go to over to his channel, check out some my GM content of the Boston Celtics. 
He has Boogie on his team, and he's a beast with Boogie. But how could you not be a beast with Boogie? And oh my goodness, Ola Depot, he killed this man, Isaiah Thomas. I'm sorry, Isaiah Thomas. I didn't mean to kill you right there. I was trying to be nice, but you got in the way, son. You got in the way, and I had to murder you. That was some Brandon Knight stuff right there. But uh, yeah, that was crazy. But I guess the Celtics, man. They're a pretty good team, although Isaiah Thomas absolutely got murdered right there. They're up by four points. Randall draws the foul, almost in that one. But this is probably the biggest free throws of his career. He makes the first and the second. And look at this, it's a two-point game, 6.7 seconds. All we need right here is a steal. It's a clutch situation, and we get a miss. How did he miss the ball? How did he miss the ball? You should have seen my live reaction. I was screaming like crazy. He misses that free throw. We have a chance to tie up this game. I mess up the controllers and I pass it off instead of having a shot. But how did he not even get that steal? Ah, oh, that is some Hall of Fame 2K cheese right there. It's annoying. It's annoying. If, if this was not on Hall of Fame, I guarantee that would have been a steal. We would have gone the other way and tied up this game. But I play on Hall of Fame, and that proves it right there. But now we're up against the Clippers in the Battle of LA. And you know the Clippers like to dunk the ball, right? But we're going throwback. We, we're the Showtime Lakers now. Forget about the Magic Johnson, James Worthy era. Denied. Get that out of here. We're the, we're the new Showtime Lakers now, all right? You got you to deal with that. Randall, not Randall, Russell, it's, it's, I'm getting confused between Randall and Russell, but Russell putting on the moves right there, up against CP3, getting the lab to go, he, he was crossing them up, but the Lakers are the new, like I said before, we're, we're the new throw, uh, throwback, not throwback, whatever, Showtime, Showtime, we're the new Showtime Lakers, that proves it right there, Oladipo throwing it down, and you're going to see Joel Green goes for some monster dunk. This game was just full of dunks. I'm not even going to talk about it. Just watch. Just watch. Randall throws it down. Griffin throws it down. First quarter is coming to an end. Get that out of here. Kobe Black Mamba Bryant says, I'm still a part of this Showtime team. Get that messy trash out of my house. I'm still the franchise player that the Lakers need. I'm still the old Black Mamba that we want to see. Not in my house. Well, not today at least. Not until I retire. Kobe sends it back. And Green throws it down over DeAndre 3000. And you're going to see this wasn't the first time he throws it down in this episode. Not even close. And one. Well, at least it should have been an and one for Joel Green. But this is an and one right here. Get dunked on. That is young plays for the Clippers in this series. But, man. He got to play better defense if he wants to play for the Clippers. Otherwise, they're going to trade him. <laughs> but nah, I, I, I like Thaddeus Ish Young. I'm a huge Thaddeus Ish Young fan for those that don't know. I don't know why. He's not even that good. I just, I just really like Thaddeus Ish Young. But anyway, you know how we're going to do it. Simulate to the fourth quarter. And now, as you can see, we're down by... Oh, we're up by two, actually. Joe Green throwing it down again because he is our beast. DeAndre couldn't stop him. Neither could the four guys in the paint. But this was where the dunk game started. Griffin on one end, Randall on the other end, DeAndre on the other end. This is like the only shot that gets taken in this last quarter. Gerald Green makes it a tied game. 77 to 77. DeAndre throws it down. We get a lob with Gerald Green. Because, you know, like I said, we're the Showtime Lakers. Green's throwing it down. Look at this. Kobe with shot clock winding down. Boogie on the boards. Throwing it down. That's like a Kobe and Shaq type thing right there. You know, you got Kobe taking that last second shot. If he misses, Shaq's got his back. DeMarcus is like a mini Shaq in this episode. Not just that, he's like a mini Shaq in this series. And in real life, and one. This man, Boogie, draws the contact, goes up with it, gets the foul, and one. And he makes the free throw because it's DeMarcus Cousins. Chris Paul... With the game on the line, you know he's going to come out clutch. He gets that to go. Get that out of here. Randall playing this defense. I have to speed this up, but this is what we need right now. A game winner, and I miss. Well, it wasn't even going to be a game winner. It was just going to make us up by three points, but this is what happens. Are you kidding me right now? So I had to call a timeout. I had to win this game. 5.8 seconds left. Kobe Bryant, the black mamba. He says, you know what, Randall? It's your time. That shouldn't have been a foul. It was a foul. And this 
is Julius Randle's clutchest moment in NBA history, in his young NBA career. He ties up this game. So this is pretty much for the win. Julius Randle, for the game, is cash. Julius Randle is something else, I'm telling you. Not in my house. Not today, at least. The Lakers come out on top. We win this game. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, leave a like on the video. Joe Green went off. He, he's a beast. I'm so happy we picked up Joe Green. But if you guys enjoyed, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Let's see if we can reach 600 likes. I'm out. Peace.